Good morning, friends and family. John Miller, your Lake Stevens Realtor, coming in here on Monday, June 1st, 2020. Um, and a brief coronavirus update. Today's the end of our uh, first day uh, ending our lockdown. We are going into our phased approach from the state of Washington. Um, and uh, Snohomish County applied for a uh, and the exemption to move into phase two. The state will be reviewing that this morning, so keep your fingers crossed that we can go into phase two. At phase two, we can reopen our office. Obviously, there are a number of restrictions, but we expect the real estate market to pick back up after uh, after we go into phase two. And we actually did see a lot of properties go into uh, go on the market here last Friday, so a lot of people are gearing up for that anyway. Uh, at any rate, uh, today, today's question, uh, coming out of Lake Stevens, Washington. What uh, should I buy or rent, or what factors should I consider in my decision to buy or rent? And that's a very common question with home, with uh, home buyer, potential home buyers. And uh, there's a number of answers to that. There's a number of factors that you should consider. Uh, number one, how long are you gonna be in the area? Uh, typically, the, the rule of thumb is if you're gonna be in an area longer than two years, typically you're better off buying versus renting. Um, yeah, there are other factors involved, which way the market's going, both the rental market and the real estate market. You know, those many times those will be in opposition here in the Northwest. Both of them have been appreciating, which is, has stymied a lot of home, home buyers and renters. Either way, um, uh, another uh, answer, uh, are you going to be going, or another question actually, are, you gonna be, are there any other ma major life changes that are upcoming? Are you getting married? Are you going to be having kids? Are you going to be buying a dog? I mean, all those things are things you want to factor in. I know buying a dog seems very uh, uh, trivial. However, if you're going to be buying a condo and a big dog, many times those two things just aren't going to work. Um, obviously, the, most of this is has to do with your financial position, um, you, uh, specifically your tax position, your income stability, your job stability, um, what kind of down payment you've been able to save, um, and uh, your credit. So those are all things that uh, a mortgage lender can answer as they're getting you pre-approved. Um, if you have, you know, it doesn't really cost you anything to get pre-approved, or if it if it is, it really isn't much of anything. Most lenders can help you uh, uh, or work with you, especially looking at your credit report. If there's things that they can, things you can do very quickly to improve your credit scores, so when you are ready, when you do see that home that you, that was really going to work for you, you're able to pull the trigger very uh, and uh, get in a contract. So any questions about that, obviously, let me know. Happy to discuss that with you. Um, and see what the best course of action is for you. Interest rates, uh, 3.15 on a 30-year fixed. Again, phenomenal rates. If you need a referral to a mortgage lender, let me know. We can get you rolling. Everything's going to be, uh, you'll probably, many of you will probably be hearing from me this week, both buyers and sellers, as everyone, uh, hopefully, everything hopefully returns to normal. Uh, that's it for this week. Wherever you are, stay safe and healthy. We love you, and we'll see you next week. Bye.